Hello, ladies and gentle friends. Oh, did you see what I did there? Welcome back to the Outlast walkthrough slash campaign tutorial thingy thing. I believe this is the last episode. It may or may not be. Um, what happened the last episode... Oh my god. Oh my god. Anyway, what happened the last episode is we met Dr. Where Nikki. Turns out he's crazy alive. And, uh, we, he ordered us to kill Billy, a.k.a. the Wall Rider, and holy shit, I think this is him. Wow, look at this. That's where Billy is? Wait a minute, wait a minute. I wanna, I wanna read the note. Where Nikki's machine? The assembler, the fee chamber, the precursor molecules, vague memories of nanotechnology articles I read online. Probably drunk, probably distracted, not nearly enough to know how to destroy it. But Billy is the center of it. Find him. Kill him. End this. So, we are trying to kill Billy, aka the Wall Rider. Alright, let's just go on in. Turn off the valve for the life support fluid thing. Alright, so there's valves, huh? Are you gonna chase me, bro? We're friends. So, I'm gonna assume the Wall Rider just ain't gonna let me turn him off. I'm gonna guess. That's, that's a pretty solid guess. So, let's see what we can do. So we just need to find some valves. Huh. Oh. What's my guy think about this? This is Billy Hope Billy Hope's lungs, his liver, his life support, a machine the size of a football stadium to keep one lunatic alive. Fuck it all, break it all. He has to die. Okay. Billy Hope must die. These are his lungs? Really? Spooky. Oh, here's a here's a file. This may be the one of the last ones. From the personal record to Dr. Wernicke. Frankenstein, the modern Prometheus by Mar Mary Shelley, publici published anonymously in 1818. Chapter 4 expert. Learn from me, if not by my pre precepts, at least I'm probably reading this wrong. I don't care. At least by by example, how dangerous it is the require acquirement of knowledge and how much happier that modest man than he who aspires to become greater than his nature allows. Oh, okay, okay. Alright. So we're gonna break his lungs, huh? I'll turn it off. Do not turn valve. Oh, we're gonna turn the shit out of the valve. Cut off the electric supply from the sub-lab generator. Okay. I'm really surprised nothing's chasing us. Oh, shit. Judging from the music, something's totally chasing us. Okay, so... Oh my god, that's him? This poor guy. Billy Hope. From Billy's patient records, he ought to be 23 years old. Looks like at least 50 years of rough road pain scratched deep into what I can see. Killing you would be an act of kindness. I agree. Is that thing still chasing me? Oh my god, it is! Holy shit, that scared the dicks off me. chasing me that whole time or else I wouldn't have stood in front of his his host body and looked at him like a tart okay so did we turn the valve off? we did okay just start running bro cause he spawned somewhere just run this guy is really good when it comes to running that's some good cardio open that door I don't see him. But he's there. <laughs> well, that one's full of blood. So there was more than one host for this program. Oh, 
Oh, are you kidding me? I could have I could have made it had I fit through that. Wow, Mr. Whips, come on. But I better keep running anyway. I don't see him. This is a lot of goddamn steps. I'll put the camera down for now. Oh my god. Oh, nice jump, bro. Yep. I'm gonna kill you, bro. I have to. For the greater good. Wait, is there a file over here? Yes, there is. Oh no, my controller is getting low. Hold on, guys. One sec, I'm gonna grab the cord and plug it in. Awkward. This is sure pretty awkward. What's going on right now? Mr. Whips, you should have thought of this, but now you're kind of derp and looking retarded through the playthrough. Okay, got it. Let me read this file real quick. Oh, shit. Okay, well, let me go to the very bottom. Da -da 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 -da. Permission to proceed. Please find attached the permission to proceed form from patient William Hope of the Murkoff Charitable Psychiatric Program at Mount Massive Hospital in Colorado. He was probably stoned when he gave permission. The form is standard and all relevant lines have been signed. It appears Billy is unaware of his mother's recent guided cardiac arrest he is submitting to the experiment with understanding unfounded of financial remuneration to his mother and a charitable contribution to her church where Nikki having read the boys dream reports believes he has a normal stereopedic potential wow what a, what a dickhead turn it off oh, good. oh I thought he was gonna blow up okay. okay so now I run back So, did that kill him? Is he dead, like, right now? I sure don't know. Nope, he's not. Oh, God! Oh, my God, look at this guy. Ah! He's toying with me. Get up. I don't care if your legs are breaking. Broken. Just get up and run. <laughs> what do we do now? Let me read the objective. Is there a computer? What do I do? I assume I go up here, right? Nope. I done goofed. Press buttons. Yes! Yes! Kill him! Die! Oh god! Ow! No! Oh shit! Come on, he's gotta die! Record everything! Oh my god! Why won't you die? Oh, I think he's dying now. Oh, he went inside of me? <laughs> My guy has some pretty broken ankles, I guess, right now. Yes! We did it, I think. We killed him. We did it! Woohoo! We did it, guys. We killed the GG man, the evil being. Oh, my guy's his legs are muffed up. I can't run. Hold on, what was my guy's final, final message about all this? Death of hope. Billy is dead, the wall rider of the swarm. Whatever it is, unmade with him. Whether I escape or die here, I am free. Can I take this file though? I never read it. Ah, uh, I'm all right. <laughs> that was a lot of big words. Oh, we're, we're so close. Come on, bro, get up. We did it. 
We killed the wall rider. Come on, bro. Stay strong. It'd be cool if it showed his legs all fucked up. Come on, record everything. Oh, I can't even sprint. Well, obviously, I got dropped like 100 feet twice. There's the exit. Come on, you could do it. Record everything. Yeah, this really feels like it's going to be the end of the game. I really doubt it's going to go any further than this. I mean, how could it? The story wouldn't make any sense if it did. Two years later, he's living in an apartment and then a ghost in the bathroom. No, I really doubt that. Why am I hearing, like, whispering shit? There's the exit. Come on. You're there, bro. Get up! Oh, shit! Holy dicks! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, God! No! No! Oh, God! A host. Yes, I'm the wall rider. Wow. So that's it, huh? <laughs> so our guy became the host. So if I die, though, does that mean? The wall rider dies too? I don't know, does the wall rider keep me alive? Ooh, spooky shit. So, what did you guys think of Outlast? Did you enjoy it? Did you enjoy me playing it? Leave a comment on what you thought of this series, guys. I'll give my little personal opinion of it. I thought it was pretty damn good. I liked it. The there were some cool elements with the you know the whole night vision. The graphics were obviously outstanding on the PlayStation 4 just as they were on the PC version. I'd imagine, I even though I'd never seen any gameplay footage of that. Um, some stuff I loved about it was that, you know, it was pretty good, it was fast-paced horror action. What I didn't like about it is, I feel like the game was too short. I really did, I feel like this could have been longer. But, other than that, it's my only complaint. You know, these these red barrels, the red barrels got, that made this guy, you know, the, in, the, the developers, whatever. They did an outstanding job, shout out to you guys, you made a pretty kick-ass game. And I hope for a sequel or DLC. Because if there is, I will come back and play it. But outstanding job, guys, to the developers and all those shenanigans, all the development stuff. So, anyway, guys, thank you so much for sticking it through with me to play through the end of Outlast. Thank you for putting that with me screaming, just rushing through the game, and all those fun shenanigan-filled moments. So, thank you guys so much, and I will be ending this series right now. So, thank you guys so much. If you enjoyed the series... Please leave a like, and if you're not already, subscribe for more content. I'll probably start covering other horror games now. Horror. Not horror games. Horror games now. Anyway, this is Mr. Whip signing off. Thanks, Outlast, for the outstanding time. Adios.